Welcome back to Talking Safety Lesson 5, Know Your Rights and Responsibilities. In this lesson, we'll educate students about the important legal rights they have in the workplace. We'll use the Are You a Working Teen fact sheet to educate students about their rights and responsibilities. There are two activities you may choose from for this lesson. They include the Know Your Rights quiz game in Lesson 5A and the Labor Law Bingo game found in Lesson 5B. Pick the activity that works best for your class. Because bingo is a well-known game, in this video, we'll demonstrate how to play the Know Your Rights quiz game. For this lesson, you'll need slides 45 through 47 in the Talking Safety PowerPoint presentation, a flip chart in colored markers, copies of Student Handout 14, Are You a Working Teen fact sheet, and prizes such as candy, pencils, or stickers. You'll also have to research your state's minimum wage. Today, we're going to discuss the important rights and protections and responsibilities that young people have on the job. Before we begin to play the game, it's important to remember that employers have the main responsibility for providing a safe and healthy workplace. But everyone in the workplace, including you, has the responsibility for helping to keep all workers safe. There are federal labor laws that protect young workers, but each state also has their own child labor laws that may protect minors even more than the federal laws. I want you to take a few moments to review this fact sheet that gives you more information about your rights and responsibilities as young workers. The fact sheet provides state-specific information regarding minimum wage, Equal Employment Opportunity Commission, EEOC, federally prohibited occupations, work permit requirements, work hours, and the agencies to contact to report different types of workplace problems, including OSHA, which is the agency they can file a complaint with about a safety and health problem anonymously and confidentially. It's illegal to be fired for reporting a safety and health problem. The fact sheet also discusses important responsibilities teen workers have, including to follow safe work practices as directed by the employer and to report job hazards. Please discuss those areas with your students. Now that you know a bit more about your rights and responsibilities on the job, we're going to play the Know Your Rights quiz game to review and reinforce key information about federal health and safety labor laws. That's why I divided you into groups of three and asked you to pick team names. Instruct the students on the rules of the game and as the game progresses, engage the students in a dialogue on the underlying concepts represented by the questions and answers. Here are the rules. Team 1 will pick a category and dollar amount from the game board. Then, a question will appear. You'll have 30 seconds to deliberate with your team and answer the question. If you answer incorrectly, then the next team will have a chance to answer until one team answers correctly or all teams have been asked. Whichever team answers correctly wins that dollar amount from the question. And we'll take rights on the job for 300 please. These are two rights you have if you're hurt on the job. Oh, the right to health care and lost wages. Correct. Go again. Uh, getting hurt, getting help, staying safe for 400 This federal agency handles complaints about wages and work hours. Um, Occupational Safety and Health Administration? No, that's incorrect. Team Think Safe, would you like to respond? The U.S. Department of Labor, Wage, and Hour Division. Correct. The winner is Team Think Safe. Congratulations. See me before you leave for your prize. This concludes lesson five of six in the Talking Safety training video series. In this lesson, we educated students about the important legal rights they have in the workplace and reinforced this information through the Know Your Rights quiz game. Or, you may have chosen instead to use the labor law bingo activity in Lesson 5B to teach the child labor laws that apply to your state. We hope you found this training informative. Thanks for watching. You can get more information on young worker safety and health topics from any of these resources.